when we're finding the average of two numbers, we need to find um, the middle. It's kind of like if you had a whole bunch of books. Hopefully you guys like to read. So if you have 97 books in one pile, so let's say that's 97, and then you have 50 books in another pile, you want to organize them that you want to organize them in such a way that both piles are the same height. So you're going to want to bring these over here. Now, one way to do that, it's it's kind of like if you put um, okay, wait, 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 wait. Let's think of another analogy. Let's say you go like trick or treating with a friend, and you guys decide that when you're done, you're going to combine all your candy and then divide it into two. So it's kind of um, this way. We're we're taking all of our books, we're putting them all together, and we're going to just divide them by two. So the way we do that is um, we add the two numbers together. If you had more than two, you would add all of them and then divide by how many you had. So since we only have two numbers, we're going to divide by two. Let's do short division. So two goes into 14 seven times with zero left over. Two goes into seven three times with one left over. So when we do this, we have to add a decimal put a zero and we're going to put our one left over there. Put it to your decimal straight up. That's very important. And two goes into 10 five times. So our average is um, 73 and a half. Now you may have seen this before um, called the mean. And average and mean are the same thing. So let's do another one. And because these are all two numbers, you're just going to add them together and divide by two. So when you divide by two here, this is an odd number. So you're going to have to put a decimal of zero, just like the last one. Two goes into 19, nine times, which is 18, one left over, nine times with one left over, five. So 99 and a half, which makes sense because um, 200 divided by two is um, 100. And we had 199 divided by two. All right, we'll just do one more just for kicks and giggles. So we're gonna add these together. Looks like they keep giving us odd numbers on purpose so that you can feel like um, that you're gonna get a decimal every time. So 181 divided by two. I know it's odd, so I'm gonna to have to have a decimal there. It's probably 0.5. Two goes into 18 nine times with zero left over. Two goes into one zero times um, with one left over. And two goes into 10 five times. That is a big mistake that kids make. They forgot to put that zero there when it doesn't go in. So make sure that you put your zero. And it makes sense because 90 and a half is halfway between those two numbers. So also you want to check that your average is going to be um, between the two numbers. Okay, that's the end of the lesson.